Yeah, this Charlie. I'm, I'm sorry, this who now? This Charlie. How can I help you? Hey, listen, um, I, I'm you by I'm, who am I I'm, speaking with? I'm sorry, this is Scotty, man. I'm um I'm house sitting for Rita. She y'all. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. She told me she was going out of town. What can I do for you, brother? Uh, how far y'all down the way, man? Yeah, I'm in the house. Four or five houses? Yeah, I think, uh, let's see. Yeah, we four houses down. Okay. Now, she left me a number, man. Left me y'all number, and then she left Miss Doris number. I tried to call Miss Doris, but then nobody answered the phone. Yeah, she normally in church around this time. Rita said she was going to be gone for a minute, so you, you say you down there? Right, right, right. And she told me if I got an emergency or anything that I could reach out to y'all and call y'all. Right, right, right. Okay, are you are you busy right now, man? Well, actually, I'm in the middle of cooking my wife some dinner, and uh, got some meat on the grill. But other than that, you know. Okay, I mean, you 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 are you able to help me out with something right quick, or you got you got time for that? Well, like I said, I'm in the middle of cooking. If it's something I can help you with, I, I you know I don't mind coming down there and and uh, showing you or doing whatever it is that we need to do. Okay, Charlie, would you happen to have any paper, man? Any paper? Yeah. Um, I, I think I got some newspaper. What you trying no, to? No, 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 no newspaper. I mean some paper. You got some paper? I the, what notebook paper? No. See, man, listen, Charlie. I like I say, man. My, my name is Scotty, man. I know you don't know me. I didn't got myself in a little situation here down here at Rita House, man. And I, I, I didn't, man. I'm in a situation. I actually. I'm in the bathroom, man, and it ain't no paper in here, dog. So you saying you want me to bring you some toilet paper? I mean, if you don't mind, dog, I'm sitting here, my legs ain't got none, my, my can't even feel my, my my whole lower body, man, from butt down. I can't feel nothing, man. My feet, everything that went to sleep on me. Uh, hold up. Babe, this dude down here at Rita House saying he want me to bring him some <laughs> paper because he didn't got none sitting on the toilet. Paper. Man, look at here, bro. I'm in the middle of cooking. I wish I could help you, but, you know, well, I, mean, I, I can't come here. You say you ain't but about four hours a day. Can you just run down here right quick? I mean, the back door open. I, I have to say, man, I understand all that you're saying. But like I said, I'm in the middle of cooking for my wife. We're having a little special occasion because our kids and stuff gone, and I can't just leave her like that just to come bring you no know, paper. Now, what I can tell you to do is if Rita got one of them towels or something I'm that you're I'm not going to use no on. towel, man. I'm not using nobody's towel. Like, that's disrespectful, man. Okay. Hey, but lower your voice. Man, you calling me to help you and shit, you acting like I caused you to not have no. Okay, All I'm asking for just it ain't gonna take no more than two, three minutes. Run down here right quick and bring the paper, man, and then you get on back to your dinner. Well, what you it was sound like what you need to do, bro? You said you had an emergency. I thought the house or, uh, or the dog had got out, or, or you had locked yourself out the house. But I'm not gonna come down there and bring you no paper because that don't sound like an emergency. That sound like some personal. And furthermore, you're in the bathroom, just jump your ass out your clothes and get in the shower and wipe your ass. No, I'm not finna dog. That's Like I said, I'm numb right now, man. I need some help if so, you don't So mind, you want man. me to come down there, bring you some toilet paper, pick your numb You can't get up out the toilet if I would to help you. Legs is dead. That's why I'm trying to tell you. I'm in an emergency, man. Okay, well, that, like I said, man, that don't sound like an emergency. That seems like a little quick fix. Get your drawers and wipe your ass with your drawers. Throw them Way go get you some more. I, I mean, I'm not finna walk four houses down there to bring you some toilet paper. Your legs numb. How how you gonna get up and open the door? No, the back door is open. All you gotta do is come in here and, and and reach in here and pass me a roll of paper, man. That's all I'm asking you to do, Mr. Charlie. I understand that, but I'm not finna come down there and bring you no paper. I'm not finna bring you. Man, no bring me some damn paper down here, man. Throw you my body numb, man. Say, man, who the hell you think you hollering at? You need me. I don't need you. Well, won't you do something, man? You see I'm sitting here in a situation? Now, Rita left y'all a number that y'all will help me while I'm down here house watching, man. This here crazy, baby. Man, what the f*** wrong with you? You gonna call me asking me to bring you some newspaper. I told you that I was on in the middle of fixing me and my wife some dinner, and you come calling me talking about some paper, man. I don't want to hear no about no and I ain't coming down there to bring you no paper, man. Hello. Charlie, is you going to bring this paper, man? Man, look, like I told you before, I ain't going to bring you no paper down there. We don't wipe no on this street. Hey, hold on, man. I can't.
can't just you can't just leave me here and I'm numb like this. And I'm not gonna come bring no grown man, no toilet paper, because he irresponsible when he go into the restroom. You too wrong for that. You that this is a situation though. This is an emergency, man. Man, that don't sound like no f-ing emergency. That sound like a f-ing personal problem that you got going on. Damn, I just I'm told you before when I get off of here, man. You done pissed me off. I don't give a f- about you being pissed off, man. Matter of fact, as soon as you get your f- up out of there, you so f- bad you come on down here. I'm coming down what you do. I'm coming down there the way I am, just like this here. And I'm going to whoop your f- for not helping me while I'm in a situation. So we'll bring your f- on. I got one more thing I need to say to you that I'm going to do. Is you listening? Bring your f- on. I got some snakeskin shoes that fit right up in your f- Clean up all that f- I got one more thing. Is you listening? Man, what the f- Man, like I said, what, what the f- you got to say, man. This is nephew Tommy from the Steve Harvey Morning Show. You just got pranked by your neighbor Rita. Ain't this a <laughs> bang? Look at <laughs> from the radio station. Is this Tommy from the Steve Harvey Morning Show? <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm a whoop Rita. <laughs> got you calling my now, <laughs> man. You had me. I was gonna come down there, man, and break that <laughs> door down and whoop your. <laughs> you better be glad I'm eating. <laughs> I can't believe it, <laughs> man. You had me. I'm putting on my shoes as I was talking to you. I'm coming down there for real. You call me talking about you need me to bring you some <laughs> tape. <laughs> you wait till I talk to Rita. <laughs> she didn't get it. Hey man, I gotta ask you, man. One more thing. What is what is the baddest? I'm talking about the baddest radio show in the land. The Steve Harvey Show. Y'all playing practical jokes on folks, man. <laughs> You're listening to the Steve Harvey Morning Show. <laughs> 